Hi everyone, welcome. So we're gonna get started in just a few minutes. Um, we're just gonna wait for a couple more people to jump on. Okay, I think it's probably good to start now. So, hi everyone, my name is Sarah. I'm the HR Administrator here at Funny Bones. Um, my name is Lauren. I was recently hired um, to work for the program development of our summer enrichment program. Um, so just really quick, um, if you were not aware, um, Funny Bones is running a summer enrichment program for kids ages 8 and up. Um, we are running all throughout the summer and you can sign up for individual weeks or um, individual days as well as multiple weeks. Um, and yeah, it starts on July 6th. We have different themes each week. It's going to be really fun. Um, and the re deadline to register is Father's Day on Sunday. So make sure you get your registrations in as spots are filling up and we do have a limited capacity of the number of people that we can take. Perfect. And also talking about Father's Day, we do have a Father's Day special that we're actually launching like right now. Technically, we're going to be launching it tomorrow on our social media, but we have this nice little flyer that Lauren will show you here. So it's Happy Father's Day. The deal is you get, you're get you going to get six tall boys uh, for the price of $25. Uh, which includes this really cool can um, over my dad body by great lakes brewery um so you're going to get six mix and match um, of any of our five dollar beers and also you're going to get 25 percent off any board game or puzzle with a purchase of a six pack so just keeping in mind for father's day if you're still looking for that last minute present um and just to address the elephant in the room we are doing a giveaway for this live so we are going to be giving away this board game it's called Sutland library um, so stay tuned for the end. We're going to be doing a live draw right at the very end. So you're going to know right away if you win it or not. All you have to do is participate in the comments. Andrea is behind the screen right now. She's going to be writing down everyone's name and putting them into this bag. And then at the end, we're going to shuffle them up and pick out a winner. So be active in the comments if you want a chance to win that, um, that board game. Yeah. So for any of you that don't know, we are going to be playing Mad Gab today for our play along. Mad Gab, yes. So um, it was actually just a trend on Instagram not too long ago. I don't know if many of you played, but it was kind of a filter. So basically, they give you a phrase that is just a bunch of random words. And you it sounds like something, and you have to try to guess what it is. So we're going to be saying it to you. And in the comments, we want you to type what you think it is. Yeah. Um, um, so just as an example, um, these are the cards that the game usually uses. Um, one of the cards says, Ni go she ate. And the um, hidden message or phrase is negotiate. So you have exactly. to um, try to say the things quickly or in different tones um, to try to figure out what it is really saying. Exactly. So um, it's not going to be very competitive, but we still want you to be competitive in the comments. Try to get there first. Try to answer it first. But again, like I said, if you participate, you are going to be entered into the giveaway. Um, and yeah, I think that's all we really have to say. Uh, so we're going to get right into it. Awesome. Okay, so the first one is wreck you lure horn he calf we started with a really hard one <laughs> wreck you lure horn he calf so in the comments try to figure out what that means wreck you lure horn he calf Again, how you play Mad Gab is you're going to look at the sentence and you're going to try to figure out another sentence that it sounds very, very similar to. Like I said, we started off with a really tricky one, but <laughs> wreck you, lure, horde, he, calf. Yeah, and also just bear with us, there is some lag. Um, so if you have commented and are um, wondering why we aren't acknowledging <laughs> it, um, just, yeah, just so you know there is some Okay, lag. Shannon said regular or decaf, and Shannon, you are correct. So Shannon, thank you for answering. You are going to be getting put into our giveaway for the Sutland Library board game, which is very exciting. All right, I'll do the next one. So this one is Yule Bazaar He. Yule Bazaar He. Oh, Samantha, you got it right as well. Good job. Yule Bazaar He. Like I said, guys, just be patient with us. I know there's a bit of a lag. Um, for when we see comments to when we're filming, but we're we're trying our best. <laughs> so which one do we think this is? Yule Bazaar He. Yule 
Yule Bazaar He. You'll be sorry. Good job, Stefan. You got it. So Stefan, Samantha, you guys will all be entered into our giveaway at the end, so stay tuned for that. All right. Our next one is Ray Dot Chi Leap Hep Purse. He purse. He purse. Yep. <laughs> Ray Dot Chi Leap Hep Purse. <laughs> it's hep or heap. Hep. Ray dot chi leap hep horse purse. Pierce. <laughs> I can't even speak. Ray dot chi leap hep purse. Yeah. There we go. We got there. We got there. <laughs> it took us a while. I sometimes find if you read it really fast, it's easier to figure out what it would be. Again, Ray dot chi leap hep purse. <laughs> that sounds so funny. Red Hot Chili Peppers, or sorry, Red Hot Chili Peppers. Samantha, you got it right. Good job. Okay, I'll do the next one. This one is Apart Rid Chin Up Hair Tree. Apart Rid Chin Up Hair Tree. These are so much fun. When the Instagram filter came out, I like literally could not stop sending yeah. these. Apart Rid Chin Up Hair tree. So what does this sound like? For the new people that just joined, we're playing Mad Gab. There's going to be a random sentence like this, and it's going to sound like another sentence that we're familiar with. So, apart, rid, chin up, hair tree. So, in the comments, again, post what you think this would be. A partridge in a pear tree. You got it right. Good job, Samantha. Awesome. Our next one. Good job, Dan. You're going to get entered in for the giveaway as well. Toot, hence, to Ray Lax. <laughs> toot, hence, to Ray Lax. Good job, Gabe. You're also going to be getting entered into the giveaway at the end, so stay tuned for that. We are giving away Sutlin Library. So, what do we think this one is? Toot, hence, to Ray Lax. Good job, Stefan. You got that one as well. Lots of people got that one, actually. Shannon got it. Good job, everyone. Two tenths to relax. Two tenths to relax. Gabe got it first. Good job, Gabe. Well, it's coming up on my comments as you got it first. Like I said, there is a lag, so just bear with us. All right, we will do this one. Uh, I'll do this one. <laughs> I don't know what that says. What, what, half, week, hot, Tool ooze. <laughs> what half week hot tool ooze? This one's actually not that hard. What half week hot tool ooze? Two tenths to relax. Oh, that was Tamara, the last one. Good job. What half week hot tool ooze? What have we got to lose? You got it, Gabe. Good job. All right, and our next one is Wide Oo Youth Ink Isle of View. That's Wide Oo Youth Ink Isle of View. Good job, Sam, Shannon, and Dan on the last one. You guys all got it correct. Like I said, just work with us. We are working with a bit of a leg here. <laughs> Why do you think Isle of View? So what do we think this is? Why do you think I love you? And that is correct. Good Why job. do you think I love you? I don't even know that one. <laughs> I'm sitting here, I'm trying to think. I'm like, um. Good job, Shannon and Stefan. You guys are good. All right, next one. So this is Hun Fork Kit T. 
table. Hun fork kit table. So what do we think this is? Hun fork kit table. Hun fork kit table. For new people that are just joining, so we're playing Mad Gab. So again, it's random words in a sentence, and you have to try and guess in the chat. Unforgettable. You got it correct, Shannon. Good job. So the Hun Fork Kit Table sounds like unforgettable. So that's the whole object of the game is you're trying to figure out what these words uh, mean. We are doing a giveaway at the end. So if you participate in the comments, you get entered in for a chance to win Settlin Library, uh, a new game that we just received. So it's very exciting. Okay, I'll let Lauren do the next one. Awesome. Good job, Sam and Dan on and Shannon on getting that correct. All right, this one is Put Meow Tough Mon Missouri. Put Meow Tough Mon Missouri. <laughs> so again, some strategies you could try saying it quickly. Um, I find kind of fat blending the words together often helps a bit. Put me out tough mine mean mine my misery. Put me out tough mine misery. Is it mine? Yeah, it's mine. Yeah, mine. So what do we think that sounds like? Put me out of my misery. Samantha got it right. Good job. Awesome. Put me out of my misery. Good job, Dan. You got it as well. Um, Tamara, good job. You guys all got it. Our next one is inner bod hull or rug glass. Rug glass. So what do we think that sounds like? Inner bod hull or rug glass? Inner bod hull or rug glass. I don't know what that is. Inner bod hull or rug glass. It's funny, I can hear it, like, like when you said it, I remembered what it was. Oh, really? So sometimes you can hear, sometimes if you're playing with someone else, get them to say it, it can help. In your bod hole or rug glass. Hmm. So what do we think that is? In a bottle or a glass? That is correct. Good job, Shannon. All right, I will do the next one. So this is, these ain't our claws. Oh, sorry, these ain't. <laughs> ant. These ain't. Ant? I can't pronounce these ant, these ant are claws. claws. <laughs> these ant are claws. These ant are claws. These ant are claws. What does that sound like? As you can tell, I kind of did like the easier ones. <laughs> and Lauren did like really, really complicated ones. She reads hers, I don't even know what they are. These ain't our claws. See, I couldn't figure out this one though. That's what we were talking about, is how this game feels very subjective. What some people find as easy for them is definitely not for everyone. Yeah, that's true. These ain't our claws. I don't know, I'm just not very good at this game. Like, even when it was the Instagram filter, I always struggled so much. The Santa Claus. Yes, you are correct, Stefan. Good job. You got it right. All right, we are chugging along. Good job, guys. The next one is Thief, Purse, Touch, and You Wary. <laughs> thief, Purse, Touch, and You Wary. So for everyone new joining, again, we're playing Mad Gabs. You have to guess what these random words could mean in a, in a sentence. Thank you guys so much for joining and again stay tuned to the end we're going to be doing a giveaway the first touch in you worry the first of january you got it right samantha good job i'm gonna do this one weenie toot hop 
Weenie Toot Pop. So what does this sound like? Shannon got it right as well. Good job. The 1st of January on the last one. Weenie Toot Pop. We need to talk. Good job. You got it. We need to talk. Shannon got it too. Good job, Samantha and Shannon. All right. Next one is Mash Pool Aces Sun Tide. Mash Pool Aces Sun Tide. <laughs> Good job, Dan, on getting that one as well. Cool aces on sun tie. And good job, Tamara. Woo woo. <clears throat> this is our first successful live stream with Streamlabs. <laughs> If you guys didn't tune in last week on Wednesday, we did our play along. We came into some technical difficulties, so I'm really glad it's working for us this week. Uh, we have this lovely border around us that Andrea helped us uh, help us set up, and Justin as well. Justin gave us the whole rundown. We're really glad we didn't run into any technical difficulties. Uh, Shannon says, my shoelace is untied. Same with Samantha. Good job, guys. Okay, let's get another one. Now we go. This is one. Uh, this is Kit Tread He Fort He Cough. Sorry. Kit, tread, he, fort, hey, cough. Kit, tread, he, fort, hey, cough. So what do we think this sounds like? Kit tread he fort hey cough. <laughs> Again, I'm the type of person when I say it faster I can get it more easily. Kit tread he fort hey cough. What do we think this is? Reply in the comments. Kit tread he fort hey cough. Get ready for takeoff. Woohoo! Shannon got it. Good job. Alright, I think we're only gonna do a couple more. Get ready for takeoff. Good job, Stefan. Okay, so next one is Raid P.O. Whack Tiff. Raid P.O. <laughs> Whack Tiff. Raid P.O. Whack Tiff. Raid P.O. Whack Tiff. If you say it fast. <laughs> <laughs> Way to give it away. That was actually really, really simple. Somebody got radioactive. Good job, Samantha and Shannon. All right, we're gonna do this one next. O firm hide head potty. O firm hide head potty. Janice, thank you for participating. Yes, you got it correct. Radioactive. So O firm hide head potty. Again, Janice, I don't know if you are with us from the beginning, but stay tuned to the end. We are going to be doing a giveaway of a game. So if you are active in the comments, which you are, you will be entered in. Same with you, John. Over my dead body. You got it correct. Good job, John. So over my dead body was correct. 
Uh, I just want to mention quickly, uh, before we wrap up, we do have Over My Dad Body available for our Father's Day special. It's by Great Lakes Brewery. Um, so our special is six beers, six tall boys for $25. The little flyer is right there. Um, and then with a purchase of a six pack, you're gonna get 25% off all our puzzles and games. We just got a huge shipment of puzzles in. Um, puzzles have been super popular throughout this whole pandemic, so we're really glad. So right now, Andrea is just putting all the ballots together to put them in the giveaway bag, and then we're gonna do the draw. So stay tuned um, to see if you won or not. It'll just be a couple of minutes. So we'll just go over a couple of things. So tomorrow we do have our Facebook Live trivia with Justin that airs at 8 p.m. So stay tuned for that. His theme tomorrow is video games. Um, and I actually can't wait to play. I'm not a huge video game person, but I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, also, um, on our online store, uh, I think it's been posted in the chat. Uh, maybe not. Um, but we are open for a retail store. So we are open Wednesday to Sunday, 11 to 7. Uh, so you can come safe shop with us. Um, or um, you can shop online. So our online store is open 24-7. We do have free delivery, free shipping, free curbside pickup. So if there's any game or puzzle you'd like to purchase, um, for sure, shop online. Also, our Father's Day special, I'm not 100% sure, but I think it's going to be on the online store as well. So you can pick your six beers um, in your bundle, and then you still get your 25% off your board game or puzzle. Um, also, I just want to mention that rentals are coming soon to our store. So you're going to be able to rent. We, our collection has over 1,000 board games. You are going to be able to rent them. We're just kind of working out the logistics and the software that we're going to use um, to keep track of those rentals. So keep your eye open in the next week or so. Um, rentals are going to be coming very, very soon. Um... And yeah, so I know Lauren mentioned at the beginning, I'm just going to mention it quickly again. Our summer enrichment program is running. Uh, it's going to start July 6th. Um, our program runs from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. It's for children 8 and up. Um, and yeah, we're very, very excited um, to, get that, sorry, to get that going. It's going to be a lot of fun. So uh, I think our ballots are in. Yeah. And we're ready to do the draw. So again, this draw is for um, this game, which is called Selson's Library. It's a very cool card game that we have, and it is, of course, a new copy that we will be giving away. Yes. It was actually a part of a Kickstarter. Um, a local guy in Toronto created and designed the game. And uh, yeah, we're very excited to be giving away a copy. All right, I'm going to pull one out. Feel free to do a drum roll in your own home. <laughs> I was going to say, I only have one hand. I'm holding the bag. And the winning name is Gabe Fon. Tana. Gabe, Gabe, good job. Gabe, thank you so much for participating. Um, if you want to reach out to us or um, if we can find you on Facebook, we'll reach out to you. But it's easier if you reach out to us. Um, and yeah, we can figure out a way that you can come pick this up or we can bring it to you. We'll figure that out. Thank you so much, guys, for watching our little play along. Um, next week, we're going to have another play along. We're actually going to have some more different prizes. It's not going to be a board game. It may be some beer. So stay tuned for that. Fingers crossed. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys have a great week. Um, and yeah, stay tuned for our next play along next Wednesday. We're trying to do a play along every Wednesday. And then again, Thursday is for trivia. Yeah. Also feel free to let us know in the comments what time works best for you. Um, last week we did it at lunchtime at noon. Um, but today we did it at seven, obviously. Um, so let us know what time on Wednesdays works best for you. We would love to, um, get that feedback. Yes, of course. So, um, we will have a little, um, screen here for um, you guys if you guys want to continue talking in the chat and um, it will end in about 10 minutes. Bye guys. Bye.